This weekend, the Victoria International Cycling Festival wraps up, inviting everybody on board to take part in its signature event. The Ryder Hedgedal Tour de Victoria is set for Sunday, and the event, like its namesake, is gaining major momentum. Like Ryder Hedgedal knows how to make a headline. <laughs> Every day it's Hedgedal, Hedgedal, Hedgedal for, for weeks. Good on him. But this weekend, the island cycling community won't be focused on his Giro win, All right. his Tour de France preps, or even Olympic expectations. Instead, they're clipping in and hitting the roads for the second annual Ryder Hedgedal Tour de Victoria. We have uh, three distances, obviously, uh, League 140, Island Savings 100K, and uh, Ryder Hedgedal's 50 50K, uh, three different start points, one finishing point. So everyone finishes downtown together. And they'll be led by some famous faces. Three-time Ironman champion Peter Reed. Um, Peter Reed, the, uh, former world champion triathlete Melanie McQuaid, and Olympic mountain biker Andreas Hessler are just three of the big names leading this sea of spandex over the three distances. Last year I just did the 90K. I wasn't very fit. I used to be a professional athlete and I let it slide for a few years. I'm sure that if Peter wanted to actually drop the hammer, he'd probably leave me in his dust no matter how hard I'm training now and how hard he's not. It's really amazing to see cycling finally come into what we've always known is a great sport, but seeing everybody else kind of plug into it and enjoy it and embrace it and the over 1,500 people here this, uh, this weekend for the Tour de Victoria, I'm so excited. A snip of the ribbon marks the start of a superb cycling weekend, but keep the scissors away from this. Riders Maglia Rosa was auctioned off for charity for more than $10,000. The Tour de Victoria's namesake has stopped basking in the glow of his pink jersey and is now focused on becoming the first man to win the Giro, Tour de France, and Olympic gold. And for those hoping for a surprise appearance from the man himself... You're not going to fool everybody and have him helicoptered in mid-ride or anything, are you? No chance. It's, uh, you know, Ryder said it before. He said last year uh, riding the Tour inspired me for the rest of the year. Um, and he had a great time, so I, I know he wants to come back. So I think next year we'll have him riding.